So this is August 2017's BAM box, the BAM box, and uh, I don't know the theme. I think they actually went away with themes so they could um open up themselves to more uh, franchises that they can put each month. So I think they went away with themes for the BAM box. I'm not sure though, don't quote me on that. All right, so if you want pricing and details for this box down below in the comments. Sorry I'm a little rusty because I haven't done a video in a while, I've been very busy with work. Anyway, let's get started. First we got some paper, get that out. Oh, oh, this is the top of a box. So there's a box in here with, <laughs> here is the bottom of the box and the thing that was in it is not in there so it fell out this might be what was inside i don't know i don't know what's going on right now because i don't look at my boxes um this is really cool this is really cool just looking at it so right here this looks like movie replica dog tags for wolverine slash logan and it's written on both sides i think they did go in that box because they fit in there so that's cute. Wolverine dog tags slash Logan dog tag. Really cool. That was that was awesome. And they were heavy. They were like really thick metal, steel, aluminum. I don't know, but it was really heavy. Uh, next item. Looks like we got some more jewelry. Another box. Let's see. Ooh. Okay. Okay. This looks familiar. I don't. I don't like you though, because you're not my house. Right here. You got a uh, Hufflepuff. It's like a leather backing. It's the emblem for a Hufflepuff. Yo, that's legit leather. It smells like leather. I know the difference between fake leather and real leather. If any of you out there got the band box and you got Gryffindor, send it to me and I'll send you a Hufflepuff. Fair trade. If you're a Hufflepuff, it's a fair trade. Uh, next, we got, uh, we'll, we'll go with this. We got a patch. Thundercats. I'm pretty sure that's Thundercats, right? So that's cool. You get a nice patch. Um, the pin. Limited edition enamel pins, cool, all right, all right. Right there is the pin, and you got Mighty Joe Young on it. I'm just kidding, that's King Kong. This box actually did have a theme, I lied in the beginning. It's heroes and villains, animal influence, and the pin is King Kong, so doing pretty good right now. Wolverine, you got Hufflepuff with the Honey Badgers, uh, Thundercats, King Kong. We got a one-up card. Do, 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 do. So you got a one-up card. You have an upgraded or limited edition item in your box. That's what the green card means. So we got a limited edition or upgraded item, which I think was the pin. I think because it says limited edition, but I, I don't know. We'll see. Um, all right, art print, you guys ready? They usually have like the best art print. So let's see if they didn't disappoint this month. Oh, what? Oh, Teen Titans, okay, that looks good. So right there, Teen Titans, looks like it's signed also. This eight by 10 photo has been hand signed by Greg Sipes, who voices Beast Boy in Teen Titans. It was signed during a private signing with a band box. So you got a certificate on the back with a voice of Beast Boy. Cool, I don't know if that was the uh, the green, what the green card was for, we'll find out. Um, and then we got one more art print um, what is it? It's upside down. Oh, that looks good. Is that Spidey? Ooh, okay, Bam Noir variant. So I bet this was the upgraded one. And it looks really good. It's the Noir, or ne ne how do you say that word? N-O-I-R, how do you say that word? And it says, uh, the Bambox box of authenticity. This Bambox box fan art collection art print, Death of Gwen Stacy has been hand signed by artist Logan Peck and is guaranteed to be authentic. So, hand signed by the artist. Okay, cool. And then um, you got your little spoiler sheet and the inside of the box has a lot of cool artwork in it. The paper that shows everything that came in the box. Take it in, check it out, love it. So you got the pins, you could add three different ones. Uh, one was a Donkey Kong Jr. Is that the regular Donkey Kong? Right there, you could have got him. Or you could have got these two. I think that's Gorilla Gra, isn't it? And then you got King Kong. I'm cool with the King Kong getting that. Uh, Bambox signing with Greg Sipes. Okay, so you could have had two different Teen Titan pictures. Right there are the two Teen Titan pictures that you could have got. We got this one. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with that. This one looks kind of cool. It's green. But this is a more up-close picture of the Titan, so. All right, you got the Death of Gwen Stacy fan art uh, collection print by artist Logan Peck. Um, we did get the very limited edition 
Noir? 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 New. Uh, we got that one, the black and white one. Uh, limited to 500 only. So that was that was extra cool. I like that. And that was a really cool picture. I'm gonna put it like back behind me somewhere. Uh, and then we got the prop replica dog tags from Lo is this from the movie? It says these custom hand finished Logan slash Wolverine dog tags were designed to be just like the prop worn in the film and are screen accurate down to the last detail. That's pretty cool. Okay. I like those a lot. Then you have the Thundercats fan art collection patch from artists uh, create or destroy was the name of the artist. And then you got the Hogwarts school pins and these are the four you could have got. Right there, you could have got one of those four. Check them out. Wish we got Gryffindor. Okay, so that was everything in the box and I have to say this is one of the better BAM boxes yet that we've received because they had a lot of items. It wasn't art heavy. You actually got a prop replica, really cool. Logan dog tags, that's that's an awesome item to get. Uh, the Thundercats patch, really cool. A lot of people like Thundercats. And then you have the leather, that, and it's good quality stuff too. Uh, the leather backing emblem, Harry Potter school emblems, very nice. Everything was good, this was good. And it's, it's uh, hand signed by the artist, these right here. So I thought it was a very good box this month. Uh, very good job, Bam Box. Very nice, and I like the franchises. So if you didn't like the franchises, you might not have liked the art prints and stuff as much. But I I really enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys thought of everything in this box. Did any of you receive this box? Did you like it? Did you love it? Do you guys? I would rate this like an eight eight out of ten. This was a really good Bam Box for me. I thought really good items. <laughs> uh that's it guys let me know down in the comments what you thought of the box if you like the video please give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're not already uh hit the little bell there's a bell that rings whenever i like post a video like this one if you're already but uh it like ding, ding, ding. ring the bell dude or click it i think you click it and then it rings i don't I don't know, this is the first time I mentioned the bell. I never mentioned the bell, but yeah, cool. Uh, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up though. I'll see you guys next time. Stay solid.